What's up y'all, it's Danny, and I am back with another sewing tutorial. I am still on a roll to 500 subscribers you guys, so please support your girl by subscribing to my YouTube channel, liking this video, and giving a thumbs up. Follow your girl on Instagram at isdenny underscore and my business page at distinctive underscore stitch. In this tutorial, I am going to show you to how to make this sexy, cute, hug your curve bodysuit. Now stay tuned. The first thing you are going to need is your basic bodysuit pattern. First, I have the bodysuit. Um, and then you, you are going to need sleeves and then the neck collar. And I traced in my pattern from a bodysuit that I already had, so you could do the same. First, you are going to start with folding the fabric in half. And then you are going to take it again and fold it a half again. So now you're going to fold it two times. Next, we are going to lay out our body piece, the whole piece. Next, we are going to lay out the sleeves. The sleeves, you want to make sure you lay it out on the fold. And last, you want to lay out the neck piece. This part, I'm just going around to pin down my pattern to the fabric so it won't move as I am tracing and cutting. Next, I'm just, because this pattern is going to go on my model, I'm just making sure the arms are long enough. And um, I believe my sleeve pattern is a 22 and her sleeve was a 25. So I just came out about three inches. Now, because my pattern is a small and my model is a medium, I'm just gonna come out a quarter of an inch. And then of course, I'm gonna um, come out a little, I'm gonna cut out just a little bit over the quarter of an inch for seam allowance. Okay, so when you cut, don't cut right on the line. Well, for me, I'm not going to cut right on my quarter inch line. I'm just going to come out probably like another quarter inch over for seam allowance. Okay, and then I'm going to trace down the leg. When I'm done with that, I am going to move on to the sleeves. And again, I am coming out a quarter of an inch. If you notice, I didn't come out on the arm, like at the top of the arm part, because I don't want it. It's gonna make it longer than what it is. So I just came out on the sleeve part. And then the collar, I come out a quarter of an inch. And then I realized that I came, I drew the line a little close to the sleeve line, so I had to come over some. And I'm just gonna redraw that line. I came out a quarter of an inch. Again, my pattern is a size small. This is a closer look. Um, I know the chalk was in white. I need to invest in the black chalk so that you guys can see it better. But I came close so you can see the line of how everything is going to look. And then we're going to get ready to cut that bad boy out. Now I am just taking my scissors and I am cutting out my pattern pieces. Again, I am, um, even though I came out a quarter of an inch, I still came out probably like another quarter of an inch for seam allowance. Okay, and then I'm just coming, like I said, I'm just cutting around. Don't mind me right here, my sleeve came out perfect, you know. Okay, now I'm gonna move on um, to sewing out, not sewing out, to sewing down my collar piece. Um, and I'm, as you can see, I'm just sewing down both sides. Next, I am going to start with the back of the bodysuit. With this part, I'm going to sew down the whole entire back, leaving nothing open. Thank you. 
then I am going to begin sewing down the front. As you can see, I'm not going to sew down the whole thing. I'm going to sew from where that pin is at down because I'm going to use a zipper to put in the top part. Now, I kind of gauged it. I always have to go back to sew it up or probably have to let it out more. Um, this happens with all my body suits that I have to put a zipper in. It's okay. Um, and as you can see, um, I am just going to start from like the center of the front piece and sew it down to the crotch part, you know. Now the next thing that I'm going to do is put the right sides together and I'm going to pin around the bodysuit. I'm going to start with the top shoulder part and pin down both of the sides as you can see here next I'm gonna go ahead and start painting down the sides of the bodysuit Last, I am going to pin down the crouch center area of the bodysuit. Now it's time to begin sewing. I am going to start with, again, the shoulder top part, as you see here. Once I'm done sewing down both of the shoulder top part, I'm going to go ahead and start sewing down the sides. And I'm going to sew down both sides. Now I am finished sewing down both of the top part and the sides. Now I'm going to go ahead and begin sewing down the center crouch part. I'm going to start at the center seam and sew down on one side and then go ahead and start at the center seam again and then sew down the other side. So this is how it looks once I sew down everything. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the neck piece. Now with the neck collar part, um, I am going to fold it in half. Then when I fold it in half, I'm going to cut open um, the piece that is going to go in the front, right down um, the middle. And then I like to um, pin it down and sew it and this so like because when I'm working with the serge machine the serge can move your fabrics while you are sewing so I notice when I do this it makes my outfits come out looking a little bit more clean um so all I'm doing is pinning down the seams um and just even it out and then I'm going to put it on a serge machine and sew down the sides Next, what I'm getting ready to do is flip the bodysuit inside out and I'm going to get ready to take that neck collar piece and pin it down to the bodysuit. And as you can see, I'm going to match the seams together. So those side seams, I'm gonna make sure they are um, matched up together and I'm just gonna pin it down. And then I am just gonna take the remaining fabric and just pin down into the bodysuit. And when I am finished, I am going to put it on my serge machine and sew it down. Now 
Now, this is how the bodysuit is going to look when we are done sewing down the neck collar piece. I'm going to show you once I'm done clipping off the excessive fabric. When I turn it to the front, that's how it's going to look. Next, I am moving on to hemming down the sleeves. Once I'm done with the sleeves, I'm going to hem down the bottom of the bodysuit. And then I'm going to sew it on a zigzag stitch on my regular sewing machine. Here I am sewing down my sleeves, the hem there, and then I am going to move on to sewing down the bottom of my bodysuit. Now I am done hemming everything. Now we are going to go and add the sleeves. I'm going to flip my sleeves inside out. And then I'm going to match up the seams with the seams of the bodysuit. So I'm taking both of the sleeves, sleeve, seams from the sleeves and matching it with the seams of the bodysuit. And then I'm going to pin that down. When I'm done pinning this down, I'm going to pin the top, like the shoulder part of the sleeves. As you can see here, I'm like kind of bending it in half just so I can get that perfect center. And then I'm going to take that and pin it to the seam, the top seam shoulder part of the bodysuit. And then when I'm done with that, I am just going to take my pins and I am just going to pin around the um, shoulder part. As you can see here, I'm just gonna grab my pin and we're just going to pin around. I finished with this side, we're gonna go ahead and pin down the next sleeve side. This is how it looks with both sleeves. Now I am going to move on to sewing down the sleeves. So this is me slowing, sewing down one side and then I'm gonna go ahead and sew down the other side. And this is me sewing down the sleeve to the bodysuit part. And this is how it looks with the sleeve attached to the bodysuit. Now it's time to move on to the zipper part. Um, first, I'm going to start with, um, you know how the zipper be having that extra piece? I don't cut it, I just fold it and pin it and then later on I am going to um, sew it down on the sewing machine. Um, here I am going to show you it's gonna go quick so pay attention so I'm just gonna take that V part of the bodysuit and I'm just gonna fold it in one time and pin it and this is for um, when I'm going to sew the zipper onto that part so it's already um, gonna be folded with me pinning it down so all I have to do is just attach the zipper in so Now I am going to get ready to sew the, well, first I am stitching it. I believe this is straight stitch. It's going up and down, sewing down the zipper, that's the fabric part at the top. And then here I am going to attach. If you notice, I did not pin the zipper on. When I do that, it makes it bulky. So I am just, you know, just gliding it through. The only thing that's pinned down is the fabric. I'm just gliding the zipper on. For this part, I like to make sure the center seams of the bodysuit and the zipper is aligned with each other. So as you can see, I'm aligning them, pinning it down, and then moving on. So I went ahead and sewed down the other side of the zipper behind seams. The other thing I forgot to show you in this video is that the ending part of the zipper where I aligned the seams together, I did sew a straight stitch to keep that part down. Now we are done. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave a comment down below. Remember to follow your girl on Instagram. I'm going to leave it down below as well as my business page Instagram. I'm going to leave that down below. See ya.